Hi right, guys, uh, today I'll be showing you how to update your HCC EVO 4G LTE to Android 4.1. So we have our EVO 4G LTE here. And what you need to go is to um, about device, go to HTC software update, not firmware update, HTC software update. Click on that and then click to search for software update. This will bring up uh, a search manually from HTC. Actually, your phone will connect to the web and you should be able to get the software updates available now as you can see here it states that this update is version uh, 3.15.651.16 it's about 396 uh, megabytes now this updates will help improve certain things but also it would add it will bump your device to android 4.1.1 you get uh HTC sense 4 plus update so you've got a, a faster sense feel to the enhanced UI performance, better camera, um, fix some Wi-Fi issues, power management, as well as uh, signal strength, uh, new landing page for maps and galleries. So let's go ahead and do that. You can uh, use Wi-Fi cable only and um, let's go ahead and OK. It's downloading software. So I can see here, this is where you need to go to. I'm just going to zoom back in again. So basically, HTC software update, that's what you need to click on. Now your software system will be uh, updating download. You can see right there on the top. And once that goes through, we should show you how uh, it actually looks, different feel. But for now, let's just quickly go back and look at what we have presently. You can see what we have with uh, Sense. This is not Sense 4 Plus. Again, we are running Android, uh, this is running Android 4.0 see the feel the look uh, it's not as fast not as smooth also we'll have changes that will come to the camera so let's take a quick look at that this is what we have the camera UI here let's take a quick look at the effects and that's settings resolutions things like that so we'll show you all that and um, once the update is done we we'll give you guys the full details of what to expect so our system uh, download is complete. You want to click on that. Download successful verify and package. Hit OK. And this should set up the uh, system update. Just wait for this to go through now. You're prompted to install now. We used, we did the download over Wi-Fi because <clears throat> with Wi-Fi, of course, it'd be faster. So you see that it tells, tells you what it is. You're able to use the phone during this process, so go ahead and hit OK. Your phone will restart, do the update a couple of times, so just um, follow the instructions. If your phone is not fully charged, make sure it's charging at that time. As you can see with ours, it's not fully charged, so we'll do this and have the update go through. All right, so our update is complete. It took roughly 20 to 25 minutes to finish this upgrade. Um, and once that's done, you can see um, we have, let's go, in, let's go in and let's see what we have. See connection optimization, to answer your connections, I agree, Wi-Fi, so on and so forth. Your system has been updated. Your phone has been updated successfully. Hit OK. Uh, let's look at, and of course now it kind of brings into this, uh, uh, tutorial screen that you have when you first open up your uh, Evo 4 GLTE. It's going to X that, X, X that out. Say yes, we don't need some more updates from the Android store. So let's see what we have here. We go into the settings. About system. So we go into software information. And if you guys can see clearly, we zoom in a little closer. Android 4.1.1 and Android uh, HTC Send 4 Plus. So it's been updated. Um, let's zoom back out again. Um, it is smoother. It actually feels smooth in scrolling through. Uh, things will feel a little faster. Of course, we're spending more time with it, we'll, we'll definitely see more. Uh, in terms of the camera, you can see it, there were only three camera um, icons and now four. Of course, one for the front-facing camera, which you can switch back and forth to. Uh, you can see also the settings. If you go in here, um, shows you the video quality settings. You can do from to 720. So the camera's got some improvements in there. You've got better performance, much more fluid movements. Altogether, it's a very simple update. Again, 
the update process just to show you how to get to the update, which we, we, which we just did is to, to go into the settings, scroll all the way down to system updates, and then click on HTC software updates right there. And once you do that, you'll be prompted to check online and update your system. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions or any comments, let us know. Don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. It's all Border World for 2.0. So this is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.